You must have seen all those rich people in all their glamorous lifestyles on TikTok, on YouTube, on TV, on Instagram, just splurging away, having glamorous parties and traveling in luxury cars and traveling all over the world and spending on other meaningless stuff just to brag. If you really wanna be a millennial millionaire, this mindset is what you need to avoid. Here are six ways to develop that millionaire mindset starting right now. My name is Munif Ali and I became a self-made multimillionaire in my early 20s and I've built multiple brick and mortar businesses with billions of dollars in sales. I started making videos like these to share my life experiences and to teach others how to become successful in life and in business. If you like the type of content that I'm giving you, then please go ahead and smash that subscribe button, like the video and share it with someone who might find this useful. First thing first, why do you wanna become a millionaire in the first place? And what impact do you wanna have on people? Ask yourself these questions because these will help you visualize your primary goal. By visualizing your number one goal, you are able to become the kind of person you need to be and have a precise plan with the necessary steps in order for you to reach your goal. For example, 47-year-old Bill Gates wanted to put a computer in every household. At the time, it was a crazy idea, but he believed that computers would greatly benefit people someday. So he looked for people with the same mindset and continued to work on that vision for a microcomputer on every desk in every home. Now, it's hard to imagine a house without a computer at this point. When you're also clear with your vision, you're also going to be more prepared when things go south and it won't hit as hard as it should. Plus, you'll be more willing to do more things outside of your comfort zone. There are plenty of hardships and mistakes along the way. Just remember your vision and you'll find the courage to believe again in yourself and in your dreams. When you're passionate about something, you're gonna work a lot harder and you're gonna put the same time and energy into it as you would in a very important relationship. But if you're in a situation where you despise it, where there's no fun and you just dislike it, maybe it's a job that you're not really fond of or perhaps you're under some kind of financial circumstances that inhibits you from progressing to the next level. Try to change your mindset at least. You're not forcing yourself to love the job. It's just a matter of changing your perspective. Think of it as a learning opportunity or a stepping stone to that dream job of yours. When you work excellently despite hating the job, good things will always follow. So just continue to strive harder and you'll get closer to that million dollar goal. No matter what happens, you need to be solution focused. Millionaires are always faced with a ton of problems. As they continue to expand their business or into their projects, new adversities arise. There could be problems with logistics or pressure at work and not meeting your goals. All of these things are to be expected, but they don't dwell on these problems. They focus instead on the solutions and they bring those solutions and act on it. Embrace the challenges and face them head on. Maintain having an optimistic attitude because you'll need it when things get really tough. Remember that comfort is the enemy of growth. So a millionaire should be excited about the challenges because these are your opportunities for growth. When you have this kind of mindset, you're going to attract other people who are also solution focused and solution orientated. Get a coach or a mentor. As a young future millionaire, there is a lot of knowledge you'll need to pick up from those who have already done it and achieved great things in life. Be assertive in learning from your bosses and from your peers, hell, from everyone. That's one of the things that I did when I was young and until now I still apply what those lessons have taught me. You're also going to need a ton of leadership skills and experience because you will most likely handle more people as you continue to expand your business. Not only are you also going to meet a lot of people, maybe a lot of fellow millionaires would like to be your partner. So it's essential you pick up these skills. Don't be complacent. A millionaire needs to be growth oriented. Don't just settle with what's enough. You need to continue to expand your business and your skills and be assertive. Try looking for people who can give you honest feedback. And part of your growth will be communicating with people who trust you so that you can see where you are lacking business-wise. Remember, successful people are the ones who continue to learn and always adapt. One practice you can do to gauge your growth is by challenging yourself to meet small goals. You're not going to be a millionaire overnight, so start slow and think of the goals you can achieve, like getting your first 10,000, then move on to 100,000. Be flexible, and if you don't wanna just be money-minded, then practice your skills instead. Just a quick break. I'm here to give you some exciting news. I'm giving away a free book on money management. If you sign up using the link down below, 
you'll receive a free PDF copy. We have compiled all the best resources on money management, especially for future millionaires, millennials, and even younger. So make sure you grab a copy right now. If you like this type of content, go ahead and apply a little bit of liberal pressure on that like and subscribe button. Let me and the algorithm know that this video is valuable to you. And I'll continue to bring you more content like this each and every week. So make sure you turn on that notification bell as well. So when I release a video, you'll be notified. Flip your thinking from doing to being. A millionaire isn't someone who buys stuff to feel like they're a millionaire. A millionaire should prioritize being someone of value first rather than just the materialistic stuff that's attached to so-called being a millionaire. You have to improve your growth, your savings, your investments, your management of people. It's not always about the Lambos and the penthouses and the jacuzzis filled with women or men. Your skills first and then your savings and then evolve into the person that you really want to be. There are a lot of people out there that want to make money at any means, but build yourself first. Make sure that you have that solid core. In my opinion and experience, I've seen many people obtain money, but the flaws that they had in their characters or the flaws that they had in their personality was just magnified when money came around. So make sure you work on you first. So those are the six mindsets of a millionaire that I could share with you. Try to apply every aspect to help you achieve financial freedom someday. Remember that you control your destiny. If you enjoyed this video, consider hitting that like and subscribe button. If you have tips and you'd like to share them with me and the rest of the people watching, just comment down below. And if you want to learn more about self-improvement for the future as a millionaire like yourself, go ahead and check out this video, Powerful Billionaire Habits That Can Change Your Life. Thank you.